Hello everyone, and welcome to Power Pages Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduk, and this is tip number 255. Power Pages Security versus Dataverse Security Users. Many people new to Power Pages come from a background of Dynamics 365 CRM, customer engagement, or model-driven apps. This gives them a great head start, since many concepts are shared between the products and they all use Dataverse as their database. However, one area that is different is security, and the differences here can cause confusion. Sometimes I've seen the assumption made that since Power Pages is built on top of Dataverse, the typical Dataverse security model also applies to Power Pages. This is not the case. One big difference between Power Pages and Dataverse is that in Power Pages, Users are contacts. Contact records are associated with login credentials via the external identity table, or via columns directly on the contact table if local authentication is used. In Dataverse, users are system users, tied to Microsoft Entra ID users. If you're looking in the Pages Management app, you might see some elements that lead you to believe that users on Power Pages can be system users as well. I believe those are there because many years ago, ADX Studio had ideas about making that an option, but it never happened. So the thing to know is that when users are logged into Power Pages, there's a contact row for them. Even if a user logs in via Entra ID, that login is associated with a contact, not a system user. The fact that that Entra ID might also be associated to a system user is irrelevant to Power Pages. In our next tip, we'll look at how both Power Pages and Dataverse use roles to manage permissions, but different types of roles. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Pages tip number 255 on Power Pages security versus Dataverse security users useful.